What's cracking, fam? What's cracking, fam? It's your boy Uncle No Punk once again, fam. You know what I'm saying? Another show one just for you. You know what I'm saying? This one's gonna be about um Jaguar Wright and her um her ex man called Goomba. Goomba. Now I made views about these two. They both are crazy to me. You know, what are, what do y'all think about these people, fam? What do you think about them? Goomba sitting there he like, tomorrow. He wanna get rid of her. I had enough. He's actually ready to cry and stuff there. Then three days later, oh, the marriage was fake. Okay, cool. Marriage fake. Now I guess Goomba has um, a new girlfriend, whatever. He's posting pictures on IG. And um his ex woman Jaguar Wright is upset. You know what I'm saying? She's talking smack like she always do. You know, she try to come on now and act civilized. You no, know, she she got like um how you say like schizophrenic. She is um bipolar. Well one time she's yelling and screaming to say she act hard. Try to talk to her nice just to, to get her point of view across and see um Jerome Johnson Goomer, your mother and father. She does things like that and brings about them the man, mother, father, sister, and things there. What happened to the house? Allegedly, you know, he putting hands on her, yelling, screaming at her. Her mother must come to her, to her defense. But she acts like she's a strong black woman, right? You know, them these black women now like I'm, I'm strong. You know what I'm saying? I don't need no man, all this and that there, right? So if he was doing things like that, why why you leave him? She says that um he was financially dependent on her. She took care of him. She never got that thing for him. If this dude's a maniac like you say he is, I mean, doing things like that, why you stay with him? Unless you're a maniac too. You know what I'm saying? And what she is, she's got them crazy. She need help. They had on some kind of, um, I think a psychiatric warrant. Where they, they arrested and locked her for four days. Juiced up with some some pills and stuff, you know, to calm her down and let out. And what does she do? She goes back to, to um, not to the precinct, that so she went to some place there, some um, yeah, some office, asking about the the judge who signed the warrant. You know, she want to know who 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 did who signed the warrant. And he's like, well, um, we don't know this and that, yada yada yada. Of course, I'm gonna tell you that if you want things like that, Miss Jaguar, right? You know this. The nineties singer, you should get your lawyer and then your lawyer can find out who did something like that. For you walk inside these um public offices yelling and screaming, calling people a curse words and all the stuff there talking where's officer Maris, all the stuff yelling and screaming. Of course they're gonna call the police. Why? Because you are um how you're saying um not diagnosed. Yes, you diagnosed as crazy, that's why you put that fucking warrant on her ass. But um she's still she's known. For, for 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 acting crazy like that. So therefore, once she walks to the building, she say her name, oh, that's her right there. Hit the little button under the goddamn table, boop. And the police are alert and the police come there. Just like the one I saw last night, I heard last night. She said, oh, oh, so why you call the police? I didn't threaten you. You was talking very goddamn crazy and reckless to this lady there. Who else was there? There was nothing but an audio. You talk and yell and scream to people. Call them cursed words and every goddamn thing. They don't know what you got in your pocket. You might have a gun pistol or something there. You know what I'm saying? So they call the police there, and they, when the police come, they say, oh, you're here? You're, you're better not arrest me again. And they arrest her. He hears yelling and screaming. Ah, yeah. And so the, the phone drops. Boom. They lock her ass back up again. Of course, they don't keep on doing it. They don't keep on doing it. And what a man, her ex-man says she's crazy in there, she need to watch out. They're going to do us like Kanye. They're going to keep her locked up and juiced up inside these um psychiatric hospitals. That's what's going to happen to her, because she's talking a lot of smack about lots of people who has lots of money, you know? You know, you talk with people that they got lots of money, things like that. Um, the hand reached out a little farther than hers, fur farther than hers. You know, reach out where she can get get touched. You know what I'm saying? I ain't talking about physically hurting. It could happen too. But I'm saying far as with police and things like that. There, people got money. Watch her. Watch her. What she do? You know, and things like that. There, when she come there, arrest her. That's what happens to her. She brings it all on herself, fam. All on herself. Talking reckless. Talking reckless. You no. Know? Nasty ass mouth. I hate to see a black woman with a nasty ass mouth like that. You know what I'm saying? You don't see other races or their females talking like that. Now, as far as America, I mean, that's something different. For you American ones, y'all talk like that. But for other places, Europe, um, Asia, Africa, females don't talk the way that our females do. You know, our hood rats do. You know what I'm saying? They're not tamed. You know, so you got so you got tame your hood rats. And this Goomba dude there, he's a he's a sicko too. A psycho, sicko, psycho. Yes, he is, yeah. He won't sit there and cry to him. This and that. They'll, they'll come back. Oh, the marriage was fake and this and that. What you doing with her? You both two as nutcases. You know what I'm saying? She taking care of sorry ass. That's what it was. Now the, the um, I guess she ain't taking care of no more. Now he's coming out there. They both come out. They need to lock both of them crazy ass people up. You know what I'm saying? Most definitely. Black Tech D4. Jaguar Wright is sick. She needs help. She needs some kind of um, 
psychiatric hospital and get some goddamn some meds in her ass because right now she's off the chain there. If she keep going the way she's doing, going inside these public buildings and, and doing shit like that, she don't want to get killed. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it gets killed because they don't know what she got there. They, they don't know what to expect from her. No, she's um, unpredictable. So if someone unpredictable keep popping upside your goddamn place a bit, yelling and screaming and saying they're going to be on alert. You have one of them goddamn craziest country white boys. Where the fuck she? I don't know where the hell she at there. You be white boy, black boy, Asian boy, Puerto Rican, whatever them girl damn is. They're not gonna take that mess from her ass. They're gonna put a goddamn slug in her ass and, and be finished with her. And not gonna go, they're not gonna do no time. Why? Because she is recorded coming back and forth to places acting crazy. Very unpredictable. When you're unpredictable, you can predict a goddamn headshot in your ass. You know what I'm saying, fam? And I'm out, fam. Peace.